Hey you guys, um, readers and everybody. Um, you guys, I, I know a lot of you guys want to make me make another haul video and uh, cause I do a lot of literary criticism and then like stuff about grammar and stuff, but you're like, oh my God, you need to make a haul. And um, so, um, and to all you haters who are like commenting on my, is like, you don't have to watch, okay? You know, maybe, um, yeah, maybe I don't know anything about Toni Morrison's The Bluest Eye or Ralph Ellison or whatever, but I know about suffering, okay? Um, so my mom for my birthday, usually we just go use Berkster sh shopping in New York, but she gave me a trip to Powell's, the biggest um, bookstore in the US, if not the world. I don't know, there's that one Shakespeare one in um, Paris, but um, so i show you what I picked out. It was like 90 bucks altogether, um, but um, first one is Jane Austen. I've read all of her stuff and I was like, mm, but this is really good. You might want to check it out. It's Emma. Um, this is amazing. It's the um, Anthology of Indian Literature. And I don't know if you can see it. I just put out this detailing. If you can just see that. I don't know if you can see the details of that scene. Okay, I'll read it to you. Um, the elements of sovereignty, the king, the minister, the country, the fort, the treasury, the army, and the friend, and the enemy are the elements of sovereignty. Can you, I mean, that is amazing. And it's really, um, it's so beautiful. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see it. But um, then my mom's like, oh, can you pick me up a chicken soup for the salva? It's like, chicken soup for the bullshit. Like, why don't you just go to a Christian bookstore where they're just like making crossword puzzles? Like, have you read the Bible? I have. Why don't you edit? You know, Galatians, you don't even need that. Anyways, um, okay, so I got that. And um, Margaret Atwood, a writer on writing. Oh my God. You guys, um, I know you watch the videos, but I'm also writing a book, not a blog. I'm not in a typing pool. I'm writing a book. So this is amazing. Love and Shadows, Isabel Allende. She is like my favorite writer. I love you, Isabel, if you're watching. She's probably not watching. <laughs> but um, she's so amazing. And um, you should just really pick it up because I got this. This book of Love and Shadows, 75 cents. I mean, you're, I'm gonna have this forever for like the rest of my life. Um, it's a classic. When Things Fall Apart, I heard it was good. Chinua Achebe, I'm not pronouncing that right and I'm really sorry and just wanna say that I didn't know. I mean, a lot of people pronounce it um, Chinua Achebe or something, I don't know. Um, I don't know everything, you guys, even though I got 700s on my verbal and my math. <laughs> so I was at the bookstore, and this is crazy. The saleswoman's like, oh, don't you want to have youth fiction? I'm like, young adult fiction? I'm like, you don't tell me where to shop, okay? I know what I'm doing. And this is amazing. I picked up Homer's, um, the, it's like, why don't you shop an adult fiction, right? It's like, why don't you read those stupid vampire novels? Um, okay, it's like, there's no story. Where's the story? Um, Homer the Odyssey. And I was like, okay, I don't even want to get this. My dad reads it all the time. And it is like, this is me. It's like, I'm on this journey, right? It's, you know, when you go, oh, that's not going to fit me. You know, because I'm, um, I'm not like that, or it's just not my style. This book, I mean, it's kind of great, like, if you're going on the bus to school or if you're at a club or something just to bring, like, a book. Um, you know, just something that's, like, casual or you're going on a picnic or something. Bring this. It is, it's really, really good, and, um, and it goes kind of with everything in life. Um, okay, I only have so much time. Okay, love and shadows. Um, okay, this gets serious, you guys. Um, I wasn't gonna talk. Okay, my my dog died um, last time. My dad hit her with a car. And um, so I just got all this stuff like the mourner's dance, what we do when people die, and um, unattended sorrow, and that shit is 
I shouldn't swear. <laughs> My mom would get so mad at me. Um, but that's language. This shit is fucking brilliant, mom. <sighs> um, but it's fucking poetry. And okay, I think that's it. Um, I didn't miss anything. Anyways, Powell's. Thank you so much. And um, next haul, I'm going to, um, there's a Super Crown that's closing. They went bankrupt, but um, they still had a, a, a Super Crown in um, a place in Connecticut. Me and my mom are gonna go and just like check out what they have. Cause I, a lot of times they have plays, you know, cause nobody likes Sappho or whatever. It's like, have you ever read it? Aristophanes, the birds. Oh. I just wish I could like be back there when they made that. Anyways, you guys, I will make another video soon, another haul, and um, thanks for watching, and um, stop watching and go out and read. <laughs> oh.